there are circumstances in your design where you will need to rotate an item on your plan. As an example of this, let's look at building an island. I've dragged a drawer base 24 onto the floor plan, and when you first drop it, you'll notice that there is a purplish line, pinkish purple line on the uh, back. That line always indicates the back of the item. As a default, when you drop an item on the plan, it faces the bottom of the screen, meaning right here where my cursor is, that's the front of the cabinet. Now, in this circumstance, maybe this island needs to face my sink base. If I right-click on the cabinet, there's an option here called Rotate. When I click Rotate, I move my mouse, and you'll notice that you see the purple line as I move that's showing the back. I rotate it to face the proper direction, and if I right-click again, that gives me the ability to move it again. Right-clicking once rotates, and once I get it set, right-clicking again allows me to adjust where it is on the plan. I can do this from scratch as well. I could take a base 30, drag it over, I can right-click, and I can rotate that to be aligned, and drag it and let it snap right to the base 24.